What's happening, folks? Back with another reaction. Back with some more Erasure. And we're going to listen to a B-side from the Wild Era 1989 album. Uh, shout out to Seb, who has shared this extra material with me. And the tune we're going to listen to is called Super Nature. So this uh, is an interesting title in the sense that it makes me think, obviously, of nature, but on an extended, expanded, or somewhat more significant level. So whether this is like a nature personified and perhaps, you know, it's a song about the world we live in, whether that's like actually an environmental message or more just about what it's like in the real world to exist as a human being. Um, or, you know, it could be sort of like a phrase that fits into like a narrative and it's not so much about like personifying nature or seeing it as like this force, um, but seeing it as like the backdrop of human affairs and, you know, perhaps like because humans, we have sentience or what we call sapience, uh, which is, you know, it's still a funny thing that humans call ourselves doubly wise, homo sapiens sapiens. Um, but yeah, perhaps it's more about the way in which like our sort of deliberative sentient sapient existence on this planet takes the natural world to like another level for better or for worse. So I guess even that, as I think about it, would maybe fit in with like an environmental or like natural world sort of um, interpretation. So maybe it'll have something to do with that. Maybe not. Let's find out. This is Erasure. The tune is Super Nature and it's a bonus tune or like a B-side from the 1989 Wild Album era.
maybe it is the sort of environmental idea that I was thinking. somewhat in the direction I was thinking in advance. It's funny though, the first time I heard the chorus, maybe even the second time, I was thinking like, maybe it could use more than just the title phrase. It, like, I felt like there should be maybe like a quick, like kind of staccato line between those long super natures. Uh, but by the time we came back around the third time, I was sort of like so into the tune that it felt right. It felt like it did fit. So um, yeah, even over the course of that first listen, my feeling about the uh, chorus sort of evolved. So. Um, yeah, top tune, uh, really enjoy the sort of enthusiasm and the groove of it. Again, it had a bit of a funk, um, but yeah, it also seemed to maybe um, have a bit of a like globally conscious message. So in any case, let me know what you think. I will see you next time. Peace.